Uh, relevant about let me tell you something. I just tried to go live. I just sent a request to go live on her page. She won't let me. She won't accept it. She won't accept it. I just sent her a request. I'm, I screenshotted the request to go live. If I'm lying, go live. Let me let let us talk face to face. I'm the liar. She wants to paint this. Oh, you're delusional. You've been messaging me first and foremost, y'all. I never said me and her didn't talk. I never said me and her did not communicate in DMs. The thing is, the thing is, she's telling there's some truth to every lie. So say, for instance, that time when y'all seen me, when I showed y'all the message of me asking her about a bank and me asking her about something like that, I might have did ask her about a cake or something. So whatever little app that she's using to make her whatever app she's using to make her DM thing, she's just taking information that I really did say. You get what I'm saying? My kid's birthday is on October 8th. Scroll down my page, y'all. I made my own kid's cake's birthday. All right? I'm, I, I, I made my own kid's cakes. All right? So my thing is, I told y'all my last time talking to that girl was October 25th, 2021. So if I did say actual October, in October, she said I asked her on October 3rd about a cake or something of that, I mean, or something like that, whatever. If I did ask you that, that wouldn't be, that might be true. I don't recall asking her that. But what I will say is, you guys, no, I know it's not that y'all. It's just, it's just, I've never been blatantly called a liar. I've never been like, just like, oh, she's delusional. She's obsessed. Like, that's not my style, y'all. And anybody who knows me knows that's not my style. That's not my thing. Yes, I do love my family. I do love my kids. Yes, my kid's birthday. But she, she. My kids' birthday are on my page. She's doing like, oh my goodness, I can't because the girl is smart, or at least whatever they, whoever they have helping them do whatever it is that they're doing, they're smart. They're smart, okay. But I tried to, I came on there with my page and tried to go live. I requested, I requested to go live. She not finna let me come on there because she's what she's doing is she's deflecting, taking y'all all around the world. And let me just be clear. We never discussed no Melody song. You get what I'm saying? Like, she's talking about the song that's about her. Like, the girl is talking to herself. She knows what she's doing. She knows what she's doing. And she's good. All right. Then she's bringing, yeah, because when is her kid's birthday? When is her kid's birthday? Like, my kid's birthday is all over my page, y'all. I'm very hands-on with my kids. I made my own kids cakes for their birthday. These are things that y'all can go learn about me on y'all own. She wants to make y'all feel like I'm some type of crazy delusional chick. Like I said, I had 140,000 followers. Go back and watch the video. Since, since I'm delusional and since I'm a fan of her and since I knew who she was before I start talking to her, go back and watch that live. Carson, but you're popular. You're so popular. Like... Ooh, baby. And then she's talking to herself in a vulgar way because she's smart enough to be like everybody who knows me. She's so direct. She's so straightforward. So she's trying to sound as if that's how I would speak. But where you messed up at was when you my BD, I would never. That's not even my lingo. I don't, my BD, like that's not something I would write, something I would say. The whole world who knows me knows it's my boopy. First off, it's either if I'm explaining exactly who my husband is or my boopy. Anywho, I do not understand what's going on. I'm just gonna, you know, I'm at this point, I'm just gonna leave it to... If we ever run into each other. And then for everybody who keeps on with the take it to court, sue her, sue her. She's not mentioning my name. She's smart enough to know. And this is this is the difference. When I came with my information, I'm calling it all out because I'm willing to say, absolutely, this is what happened. This is what she told me. If I had to go to court, this is exactly what she said. Blah, 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 blah. When I post me on her messages, it's showing our names back to back. Our direct messages. When she's showing mine, it's saying Instagram user. 
<laughs> Y'all keep talking we look alike. No, we don't. But when she's showing my name, it's saying Instagram user. Then she's saying this girl is delusional. If it was me, it would have said, I would have actually said Ariana is delusional. But she won't say things like that pertaining to me on there. You know, people keep on trying to say I should sue her for defamation. She's not putting my name. She's not posting my name. So regardless of what she's saying, as long as y'all know who she's talking about, she doesn't have to directly say it's me. She's smart or she has a team who's saying, don't go on there and actually say her name. Ooh, she's good. That's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to say. And y'all couldn't get her to discuss the tape. That's the issue at hand. That's the, the real issue at hand. Talk about the tape. Did you or did you not tell Carson Blue that Martell asked you to make a fake page exposing his wife? Did you or did you not? And then you even went as far as saying, but the video is of them. He's mad at me. He feels like I should just listen. Like, come on now. Yeah, I'm going to show y'all hers. I'm going to show y'all every message because I don't have nothing to hide. I don't care. Like, like. For people who even felt like, oh, it was even possibly a clout chasing situation. Like I said, all I care about is my money. I'm going to be car regardless, no matter where I go. All right. I'm going to make money regardless. The show is not my concern. Now I'm probably blackballed from the show. That cast probably can't even speak to me anymore. I've divulged real information about Ariane and Martell. Okay, and let me be clear. I did not see Martel say this to her. I did not see the video for myself. I'm going solely off of what Ariane said. But she knows what she's doing. She's using an app. She's trying to talk. She's trying to talk like vulgar or foul and saying, I F them be, I mean, F them. I can't wait till I get down there. Like, Ariane, what I'm gonna do? That, what I'm gonna do? What I'm gonna get down there and fight them for you? What I was gonna? What was I going to do? Go down there and what? Why? What was I saying that to you for? The thing is, you're going around watching everybody that has posted me every interview, and you're taking information. You're smart enough to take bits and pieces of information, and you're saying bits and pieces of things that's already out, and you're putting it in whatever your message form where you're messaging yourself. Oh Lord. She says she doesn't know anything about a tape. Don't worry, we know she's lying. It'll all come out. She, she's lying. All right. You're right, Anthony. She, but she 100% knows about a tape. Yes, Southern Butterfly. BD is Ariane's lingo. lingo. That's what I'm saying. And that's really where she messed up for me. Because at first, I'm like, at first, I thought she was just posting messages. I'm like, what? These aren't our messages. But then I'm looking like, hold on. She's messaging herself. <laughs> he definitely called her while she was live. Please stop, bait it's no mine. Okay. Oh, y'all say he's helping her? And, all right, I am calm down, guys. And for y'all who keep saying, um, I had wrote on Martel's wall and I said I never spoke to him. You're right. I apologize. I did write on his wall. That was not a DM. What it was, was it was just on the popular page. And it was like a video of him clapping powder in the air. And I was actually being sarcastic, like smart mouth. And I was like, what was the uh, powder symbolic for? Because the video really wasn't giving what he thought it gave. And I actually thought I offended him because he was like, game time, don't be dumb or something like that. And then we didn't say anything else to each other. And I actually showed my man like, oh, I think I just pissed Martel off. I was like, but it looked stupid. The video really did look stupid. So go look at it. Go look at it for yourself. Anywho, I am done. 
Hey, hey, Detroit. I just had to come make it clear. Oh, Yama. Yeah, Yama Keisha. Like, because I, I, I did see that. And then I'm not going to lie. Like I said, every, anything that I've said, it was never, I was never doing anything intentional to hurt anybody. I was never going to say anything. So, yes, I did write that on Martel Wall. Yes, I was being sarcastic. But there was never any other dialogue. I don't know that man for real. Like, I don't know him like that. I really was just being a smart ass. And the video, if y'all go look at it, the video really was dumb. I was like, I don't know if it was some type of advertisement, but he like walk in and he clapped the powder. And it was just so, it was like melodramatic. It was, it was just like, it was just like, and I'm, I'm, and I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just a smart ass, sarcastic person. So I asked, I'm like, what was that symbolic for? I said, what was the powder symbolic for? And I laughed with the dead face because it was, it was not, I don't, I'm like, it didn't give what you thought it gave. But anywho, yeah, no, I know Mel said I'm telling the truth. I'm just saying, y'all, I'm just saying, like, it's her trying to deflect and trying to say, like, these messages are from us. And when is her kid's birthday? Like, she's so smart and stupid at the same. When is her kid's birthday? Um, Go check and see. Like, it's not hard to know my kid's birthday. It's on my page. I made my baby's cakes myself. You're smart. You're going through my stuff. You're reading interviews. You're listening to videos. You're watching everything. But you don't want to come live with me. You don't want to answer the questions. You don't want to show our messages for real. You're showing whatever that says. Instagram user, like, come on, beat it. Beat it. And if y'all believe Ariane, that's fine. I don't care no more. Like, I don't care at this point. I've said everything that I had to say. And if I be quite truthful... I gave y'all the information because y'all kept pressing me for it. Y'all kept pressing me for it. And she is behind the fake page. Her, Either her or her man are behind the fake page or one of them were acting alone. But whoever is behind the Bernicia page, which was nobody but them, is the reason why I had to expose all the information. Because y'all could have just left me alone. Y'all could have just left me alone. I would have never bothered anybody. So there we go. All right, guys. I. Who was Phenom talking about? They they are both scared. I hope you're not talking about me. I'm not scared. I'm not scared of. I'm not scared of anything or anyone. So I'm. I don't know if you're referencing me and her. Nothing about me is scared. Absolutely nothing. Oh, he made her go live. 